trying to figure out what I want to do if I want to work out again from home or go to the gym. I'm so tired. I really don't want to get up. Look, I just now come in. Broken down. I shall see what I choose. I'm so tired. Oh, man. I'm here guys it's like 4 30 but I'm here I'm here I'm here I don't know why my hips hurting the way they are Lord I don't know why but let me go in here all right y'all that's why I like to come it's literally two people in here one two love it love it love it early morning sometimes I say tops maybe four or five wait it's one more person so three but they spread out, everybody doing their own thing. All right, y'all. Massagers. I don't know why my hips is hurting. I gotta figure out what the heck type of stretches or something. It's like my hips really hurt. It's been getting worse the last like two days. Like when I sit down, get up or anything, they they feel terrible. So yeah. I worked out at home yesterday. I decided to do the chair this morning. I gotta figure out some things for these hips, y'all. Why is my brim getting soaked? Ugh, like wet. I really was sweating. I actually liked the elliptical. And I never really truly liked the elliptical, but it wasn't too bad. I got a hole in my pants. Look at this, y'all. Did y'all see it? And I cut the nails off. I gotta take this polish off. But anywho, um, oh gosh, this thing is too hard. Oh. Um, let's go to one. Okay, so I'm sweating like pig. Pig, I'm gonna go home and um take a shower. 
And um, today, um, my sister keeps saying, sis, do the ACV, do the ACV. So I, I don't like the taste of it, so I tried a teaspoon. So what I'm going to do is just take a teaspoon in the morning, and then a teaspoon, I ain't doing no tablespoon, a teaspoon, I have to figure it out for myself. It's just, it, I'm just trying not, not trying to do stuff that's going to be there, and I got to think of it like that, you know what I'm saying? Something that I know I can continue doing. So, um, I did a teaspoon. I had my vitamins and minerals this morning. No breakfast. So, it'll either be one to five or two to six that I'll eat. I'm trying to figure out if I want to do the four-hour window, just eat if I get hungry within that four hours, or do one meal at one and one meal at um, five, or if I start at two, it'll be one meal at two and one meal at six, and I'll just take um, ACV probably when I go to bed, another teaspoon. Um, I see a lot of people did teaspoons. They didn't even go that far with the um, tablespoon. Um, maybe I got to get over the hump of the taste because I mixed it with eight ounces of water and a teaspoon of um, lemon juice and I just guzzled it down so and the funny part is well I don't seem hungry this morning I don't feel like I'm hungry or anything like that but we shall see how the rest of the day goes on and how I feel because I'm gonna go to sleep when I wake up it's usually between 10 and 11 and then I only have a couple hours before it's time to eat so um, I think I can rock that out because usually when I'm getting up, I'll be trying to edit and do stuff like that. So I got a lot of stuff to do. So we shall see. And I think I'm going to be doing it like this, y'all, where I give y'all my morning perspective on what's, how I've been feeling so far from the morning, from last night to this morning. That workout was ridiculous. Um, I don't know. My hips has just been the only issue I've really been having last night. It's been acting up this morning when I got up. My husband was massaging my hips last night and this morning like I don't know what's going on I think it's the breasts and the, all that stuff sitting on them I don't know but when I'm laying down it's not sitting on them so I don't know I don't know I don't like it I don't like it I gotta get this weight off all this comes with this weight I know it is and I'm not young so I have to do this y'all and it's such a struggle oh gosh but yeah all right I'm gonna continue getting my little massage I hate watching the news I don't know why they got the news on in here Oh, I can turn it. I can turn the TV. Let's find some HGTV or something. All right, y'all. Later. Gosh, I'm sorry, y'all. Let me stop it. Hold on one second. Did y'all see? That's what it was for today. And I'll be back tomorrow morning. Hey, guys. So, um, yeah, hips still hurting. And I'm thinking I'm really wanted to, I really wanted to, um, say that I think is from my working out last night. I did a lot of stuff that derived from the hip, like lifting the legs and all the stuff that I did. So, and the winding and all that stuff. You know, when you don't do that stuff for a while, it kind of takes a toll on your body and having all this weight on it, you know, on top of it is not a good thing. So, my, my plan is to, this week here, do the apple cider vinegar one teaspoon with a teaspoon of lemon and eight ounces of water in the morning and the same thing at night and i can't oh the taste is ridiculous but so i think i can do the teaspoon it wasn't so bad when i diluted it it it, it was it was a good even taste of lemon juice and the vinegar so it wasn't so so bad um, if you decide to do this, make sure you use a straw. I use a straw. I guzzle it down with a straw. Um, maybe tonight, um, I'll show it before I go to bed, um, what I do. Um, and I'm going to take an Epsom salt soak tonight. Um, we have family day tonight. We're taking the kids to see the underwater bubble show that I showed you on one of the vlogs. Remember, I was buying the tickets just as a surprise. They don't know nothing. I haven't said nothing about it to either one of them. So they're just like clueless of it. So that's going to be happening on um tonight um and that's at six so i will try my best to eat dinner before that um yeah if it's at six i would love to have us eating dinner before that so yeah hopefully about five five thirty yeah we can eat um yeah because it's at six that's, that's the best thing it's the only way I'm going to take this polish off my nails. I'm so mad about this finger. It just messed up the whole flow of the nails. But I'll let them, you know, just do their thing. And I'll probably wear them like this, like short like this for a while once I um take the polish off. But I got to get that 
finger back to growing. I hit it on something. Um, so yeah, that's my plan for today. Um, just chilling, sipping on my lemon water. I'm about to go downstairs and freeze me some more ice from my cup. Um, and yeah, that's that's what it is. Nothing major, nothing special. It is 11 o'clock. So 12, 1, 2, so in three hours. Yep. I will be um getting getting ready to uh eat something. Just something to snack on and probably some fruits and a rice cake. And then um later I'll prepare the food about I'll probably start preparing the food about five, four thirty five so we can eat and head out the door. So yep. Yeah. Alright guys, um, Jim was a great workout today, and I actually liked elliptical if I didn't say it already, but yeah, so let's keep pushing guys, let's get through it, um, and I just hope this Epsom salt flush helps me and my hips to do what they need to do to feel better, so, alright, later guys. This is my one meal, my first meal, and my other meal will be a little bit later towards the end of my four hours, it's one o'clock. And I have some bacon in the oven, so it's going to be bacon with this, three slices. And this is the yogurt from Aldi's. And this is the granola on top of this with a little bit of Ceylon cinnamon, um, some ranch, cheddar cheese, white and yellow, some celery, and a cutie. And then I'm just adding my bacon, and that's going to be it. And I'm drinking water. So, yep, guys, variety. Like, I know that I'm I'm feeling really hungry, so I do something like this because it's not as harmful as me eating <laughs> the bread or the cakes and the cookies that I munched on a couple days ago, like thin mints and stuff like that. So, yeah, so it's a little bit better. Transition, transition, transition. Jeez, try to say that three times fast. But, yeah, transitioning and just doing better is what my mission is. That way it's something that I can continue doing as a lifestyle. So just want to share just different options. If you get hungry, pile up on more things that are a little bit more healthier than processed food. So yeah, and this is Cabot, Cabot white cheddar. And this is Audie's um, yellow cheddar, sharp cheddar. And Cabot's sharp white cheddar. All right, y'all. So this is my full meal and it was so tasty and it had me full, guys this granola is so oh my gosh it seems like it's always something in the corner of my mouth <laughs> the bomb i didn't even take the polish off don't judge me judge yourself i'm gonna take it off before we leave because it looks a hot mess well at least on this finger that finger but yeah chicken tacos today and the meat is not going to be on thawed. We have in, um, garbanzo beans in it and black beans. And we're going to mix this um, like a Spanish rice that I'm making in it along with. Um, I think we're going to do them. Yeah, we're going to do them in, um, in the uh, romaine wrap. So just stay tuned for that. I'm just preparing the rice first. I'm about to get dressed so we can go on our little family, family date. But I'm getting the rice done, so I don't have to worry about doing that when I come back. Those, um, well, my husband took the honey roasted ones. I didn't like them. You might like them, but I didn't like them. They just had a weird taste to them. So I took them back, got my money back, and another bag. And we're just going to do whole regular cashews with sea salt. Ever so, this is what I'm rocking. Got my little blue earrings that my daughter bought me years ago. My oldest as a gift. I love these earrings. I don't know if she even remembered these. Aren't they cute? took the polish off my nails and I'm rocking a hat got my lashes on no makeup at all but my bras that's it because y'all see them this uh, this is hard so no makeup I did my bras but I don't have no makeup on my face at all so I'm glad that my face is trying to clear up and um I'm rocking a denim shirt some Levi's and some um Air Maxes that are old as heck, but I don't wear sneakers like that, so my sneakers last like forever. And that's why I put the blue earrings in my ear. Don't judge me over there. It's clothes and gym stuff all over the place. But yep, this is what I'm rocking. Just comfy for our family day. Surprise that the kids keep trying to 
get me to tell them where we're going. And I'm not. So that's my cute look. Y'all can see me better this way. But yeah, that's my cute look. Oh my gosh. I be sweating. I got to bring some of them things with me. Yep. So that's what I'm rocking with my little cap. But see y'all later. Not until 6.30. And it's only 5.12. So I'm preparing the chicken for our tacos. Then I'm about to wash these little bit of quick dishes from the girls snacking and my food from earlier. And yes. So I'm going to prepare these. Season, clean these up real good and season them. And then... They'll be ready for when we come back because I'm going to cook. I'm just going to be eating a little bit late today because I thought it was at 6, but it's 6.30. So, got time to prepare these and then be on my way. So basically I have my chili seasoning, my DIY chili seasoning, not chili, Lord Jesus taco seasoning in here. And I'm getting ready to, I'm going to put this in here and then my um, black beans and uh, the bonzo beans and just let it sit till we get back and then make our tacos with the cheese and stuff. Day. It's going to be a lot and I'm going to mix my basmati rice in here that I made and then just let this marinate and do its thing and I have my homemade um taco seasonings in this and we're going to be eating this in romaine wraps I mean romaine lettuce I'm sorry y'all mm -hmm. but chicken taco Tuesday but after I get this mixed together we are getting ready to head out for our family night but these tacos are going to be the bomb, the bomb. All right, y'all, have a good Tuesday. Talk to you guys later. Okay, so here is the taco meat, black beans and garbanzo beans. Hubby just tasted it. He said it's really good. And that is going to be for our dinner. You can either do something like this, which Audi has these, if you want to get a healthier version of a tortilla. Or you can wrap it in romaine lettuce or they have different multi-grain wraps but we're going to do lettuce tonight with this so that's the chicken taco mix with my spanish rice and that's our dinner but you'll see it plated later guys y'all chocolate covered oreos <laughs> oh my gosh babe they can get they can get a couple things baby mm -hmm, they can get more than one thing look at all this stuff watch your head Riz. look at y'all and the pretzels. The girls are getting their snacks for the show. I don't know what I want. The pretzels look so good. Oh, the temptation. But I'm going to live tonight. I, 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 I'm going to. I got this. At least it's raisins in there, but it is sweet. And I got a Gatorade. So, all right, y'all. Oh, he's getting inside. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, wow. Oh, wow.
clean it and come back here. What they doing over there? They keep going back. And, <laughs> and he's doing it over there too. That is cool. portrait out of the sand. She's over in the corner. Right here. Wow. I'm trying to get a good... She keep turning each picture into something different. Wow. Just wiping the sand and wow. Wonder what this is gonna be. See how she move her hands? Yeah, jellyfish. Octopus. <laughs> wow. She just pour it so easy and just It has sour cream. I'm not putting any cheese or anything on it. I'm just going to eat it like that um, without any cheese or um, anything. I just put sour cream and some of this hot sauce and some Texas Red Hot. And that is it. That is my dinner along with my lemon water. Yep. So that's what I'm eating. 
All right, y'all. I really don't have anything else to say for tonight. I need to get my butt in the bed. It's 9.15. And, yeah, my husband said he's going to take care of the dishes. So, I'm getting ready to get my towel in the bed. And they haven't eaten yet. So, they're getting ready to eat their food as well. Y'all, this stuff is so freaking good. Oh, my gosh. I did want to say something. Um, What I'm trying to embrace is... um. I am a stickler for creating memories. As you can see, y'all see what we did and where we went. It was so freaking amazing. We had the best freaking time. And I just love to put a smile on my kid's face. I love just my whole family. My husband, we all smile. We find things um, and do things um, for family night. That is a must for us. We do not play about that. It is a must. Um, we don't share everything that we do. You get what I'm saying? Because I feel like when you're in the moment and you're really creating memories... Everything is not for everybody. We've been places, we've done things that most people don't even know about. But see, the thing is, we're not trying to live for social media and our life is not about social media. It's more so about making sure whenever God sees fit and it's time for me to leave this place, that I have done all I can to create memories, whether small, huge, large, whatever, impactive, not, you know, I mean, just that is the most important to me as a mom um and you know sometimes i feel like some people just do stuff just to share it and i don't want that like it's lots of stuff i haven't shared but um i do get requests for you guys to see certain that some of you guys who want to see certain stuff um and you know sometimes i have to see if it's okay with my family i do vlog and i do like to put stuff up but i want to make sure my kids are comfortable or if they want to share certain things, you know what I'm saying? Before I do it, out of respect from them, whether they're kids or not, as a mom, I want to make sure that if I put them in front of the camera, it's something that they want to do. Not just, oh, I'm the mom, get in front of this camera. No, that's disrespectful because I won't want nobody put me on a camera if I don't feel like it or if I'm not bothered. So I do. Don't I ask y'all anytime I, I ask y'all to do stuff that I'm like, do you want to get on? And they'll say no, or they'll say, no, I don't feel like it or whatever. I don't just say get in front of the camera. I don't do stuff like that. This is my channel, and yes, I do have a family, but out of respect for them, our memories that we create, I can share. Like tonight, it was a good time. That's something, if it comes to your city, you definitely should take your family, take your children. It was the bomb. Even my husband was smiling like a big kid, clapping like a big kid. So it was a beautiful, beautiful experience. So underwater bubble something i forgot what it's called but you guys see the clips that i put in because i wanted to share that with you guys because those are the type of things that we like to do just spare the moment tuesday night doesn't have to be a weekend doesn't have to be real expensive this was something i planned a couple weeks ago took it out the budget we know we're going you get what i'm saying just little stuff but yeah guys I'm pushing. It was a little bit of a uh, situation at that concession stand. Oh, my gosh. You've seen all those goodies. But I did have a whole box of Raisinets and a mini. They had a small Gatorade. So, I had that. I had one Twix one Twix stick from Reese. Uh, Rizzy. Reese. I meant Rizzy. And one from Naya. And one little miniature, um, like the little teeny bite size uh, Twix. And then um, my husband, I had some of his popcorn. Other than that, that's all I ate. Then I came home and ate my burrito. And I'm waiting to take my vinegar sitting on the side of my bed. I'm going to take it in 30 minutes. I want my food to get through my stomach or whatever, I guess. I don't know. Or should I wait later? I don't know. I don't know. I never um, found out is it a certain way you're supposed to take it before bed. But let me edit this, get this up to you guys so you guys can see it. And then we're going to be heading on to day, well, Wednesday. No, this will be Wednesday. We'll be headed on to Thursday. So this will be your Wednesday and we'll be headed on to the next day. Let's push, guys. Let's push. And I'll probably be doing a video on our live sometime this week because a lot of people have been asking me questions like about my nails and all that different stuff like that. So and I've been getting some emails. So I will try to get on a live and answer those questions because it's kind of hard for me to remember to get back to you in the comments. And because I do it every day, I definitely... um can't get on and comment every day because I'm, you know, my life still, I literally just met two people to sell one set of dishes and some other items. So like, yeah, that's why it's a little late. It's going on nine something, almost 10 o'clock. I need to get my butt in the bed, but I got to edit because this video got to be up at six in the morning. So let's push. We'll get remember stick to your script because you are the best at it. Why am I so tongue tied? I don't know. I will see you guys later. Get in the next video.